right lads, so starting in goal, it's pretty much the same lineup as to what we saw last match. We've got Mendy in goal, Alonso as a left wing back, we've got Brudiger, Christensen who's been solid as a rock recently, and we've also got Asper Equator on the right hand side um, with Reese James in that right wing back position. Kante and Jorginho in midfield to gain control and also win the ball back. And then up top we've got Havertz, Lukaku and also Mason Mount as well. So no Werner. A little bit surprised about that. I thought we'd need the pace on the counter, but who gives a damn? Still bloody good players. Let's get in there, lads. <laughs> Mate, I'm sorry, there's nothing we could do. But we're here now. Come on, boys. atmosphere I've seen in the Premier League without question this is going to be an unbelievable game you can hear it listen to that the Chelsea fans the Liverpool fans they're going out this is the game this could decide the title come on boys Just 
talk. But he can also counter with pace and he's so strong, it's hard to get the ball off him. The only thing that he could improve is that first touch and he's got better at it. that Liverpool won, what an eventful first half, we went down for a beer, next thing you know Liverpool had a penalty, Rhys James had been sent off, I didn't see it, however we did rush back upstairs, we managed to see Salah taking the penalty and it was a solid conversion, Mendy getting angry and there was a bit of a brawl after as well, um, the players are just coming out now but it has been a really eventful first half, obviously Christensen he got that flick on from the corner, and that was a great, great goal. We needed that. We were soaking in a lot of pressure. We managed to sort of calm the atmosphere, but not a good way to finish the first half conceding. We need to get Lukaku into the game more. Jorginho and Kante, they are doing very well. But they're under so much pressure. The press is very, very difficult. And obviously Van Dijk is solid as a rock. There's not too much space, so we have to take our chances when we get them. Obviously, we're down to 10 men now, so we're going to see if Tuchel does make any changes. But, um, yeah, all we can do is hope. A draw is probably a positive result from here, so come on, boys. Kovacic, 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 Kovacic and Thiago Silva coming on. Uh -huh. OK, we don't know who for. Chelsea won, Liverpool won, 
Um, it was an unbelievable encounter. The first half, we really, you know, we really struggled to get into the game at the beginning. We were obviously passing out from the back, not penetrating too much, but on the counter, we did pose a little bit of a threat, especially with Lukaku Havertz looking great as well in that midfield. Um, you know, Kante, loads of energy in there, but obviously, I think he did pick up a slight injury. He had to come off in the end for Kovacic. Um, what can I say? The first goal from Havertz was completely against the run of play. Um, was it deserved? Of course it was. He's been playing fantastic football why not cap it off with a goal and if you're going to get it from a set piece I'll take it any day of the week doesn't matter who you play where you play if you can score set pieces um, at Liverpool you can do it anywhere so you know well done for that Lukaku as well very direct with the counter attacking um, he tried to drive at the defenders and um, hold up play was actually quite good and the link up with Mason Mount he'd done that a few times it was, it was good to see um, I do feel like he could have maybe fought a little bit more with those aerial um, challenges and especially those just, just those 50-50 balls with Van Dijk I felt like he, he didn't necessarily go for as many as he could but he was probably preserving his energy he's a player that needs chances he doesn't make them himself necessarily but um, he's a top striker we know if we give them if we give him those chances eventually he will take them um, Jorginho towards the end of that second half you know his legs you know wasn't quite as, as agile as he needed to be so we brought on Chalaba um, trying to preserve that lead as well and I thought Chalaba was good he brought some energy into the play and he, he thoroughly deserved to play as well um, and obviously with that penalty incident with Reese James handball and the ball in the box, Salah converted. There was a bit of a scuffle after with Mendy. I like that, you know, it shows a bit of passion. That's what you want to see, especially in a game of this magnitude. Um, but I don't think it was deserved, really. I mean, we can see why it was a why it was a penalty, but a red card, I thought that was very harsh. And I think Anthony Taylor, he didn't do a bad job today, but in terms of that penalty, I think he got it wrong, especially with the red card. But the reality is we'll take a point all day long. Ten men in that second half, fighting spirit. Um, what can I say? Well done, lads.